So, very good afternoon from Nuremberg, and uh, Mark and I are pleased to welcome you to the conclusion of the trilogy. Uh, in September, Mark came over, he accepted my invitation, we went to the Betze to watch his Nuremberg play my SFC Kaiserslautern. And then in November, we uh, watched the two of them play in the Pokal. My Lautern won both times. But Mark will certainly be hoping, now that I've accepted his invitation to come back to Bavaria, that Der Club, the Legenda itself, will be able to best my Lautern boys. Now, we have a lot to show you today, uh, not least of which is going to be probably more protests in the stadium. Protests continue across the Bundesrepublik, and we're going to attend a match between two clubs that both voted no on the new DFL investor deal. We predicted on Monday's show that these protests are going to escalate, and I'll predict that again here today. We have two guests to welcome back to the program. We have uh, Irina, who is our prediction sorceress, our prediction master, and Poppy, uh, who will be uh, joining us uh, just as he did uh, over there in Hoffenheim. Poppy's coming along too. Irina, everybody wants to know, since you predicted the Dortmund-Hoffenheim scoreline perfectly, what is your prediction for today's match? Oh, I think it's going to be a draw. A draw? Yeah, I think so. Oh, okay. What, how many goals? One one. One one. That's all we're gonna get. Well, Mark and I will certainly be hoping for more. Here we got Nuremberg. We got. Uh, he's got his Nuremberg scarf on. But what does he think of the FC car? Oh. <laughs> Poppy. Poppy. That was rude. That was just downright rude. I'm gonna head on over to the stadium, and I'm gonna show you what the away fans of FC Kaiserslautern do. The way the Pilgerströmer comes out of the woods. My bets of brethren on tour. So a combi ticket, huh? Free. <laughs> Not bad, you get everything for free here in Nuremberg. It's mm -hmm. paradise. Buy your ticket, get a free train pass to the stadium. And now is the Teufel los here in Nuremberg. I wanted Mark etwas sehr, sehr schönes schauen. The pilgrimage, the Pilgerströmer of my Betze brethren, as we all come out of the woods, thousands of us. <laughs> Coming to invade Nuremberg, an endless throng of FC Kaiserslautern supporters marching to the stadium. Are you ready for this experience, Mark? I'm ready, but I've got to say I'm impressed. The numbers are just crazy, really. We, we'll, <laughs> we'll, when we get in the ground, we're going to see just how many there are.
Not good enough. Not good enough for this fight to make it like this. Ah. I'm not good enough for Nuremberg to push for the playoff play. Well, it's not good enough. Free hope, Uncle. In free hope, we trust. We can't go back down the third league. We can't. Thanks for joining us. Three, three matches this year between our two favorite clubs. <laughs> good effort, guys. Good effort. Come on. Fair play. Fair play. Well, this concludes the FC Nuremberg, FC Kaiserslautern trilogy. And we ended with a 1-1 draw for both clubs, uh, German clubs that do the little Asta, FTN, Asta, FCK here. A draw seemed a fitting end to our trilogy. And you know what else is great about football? Going out and sharing a wonderful meal with your friends. Arena, once again, predicted the scoreline correctly. Mark and I, even though we only got a point apiece, still had a good time. So it's time for me to go hop in the ground hopping mobile. It's a long trip back to Karlsruhe. Greetings from the famous ground hopping mobile. I'm on my way back to Karlsruhe. Thanks again for a great weekend, Mark. Had a blast. It was good stuff. Uh, there's obviously so much more to talk about than the result that we witnessed today. Uh, the protests that we've shown you hope we gave you a nice insider look at the passion that is driving German football fans against this investor deal. And it's going to take me some time to edit this vlog together. So the bold prediction is by the time this vlog goes live, I think that the final investor, uh, CVC, is going to pull out and this investor deal is going to be dead uh, after the protest scenes that we saw across the Bundesrepublik and particularly at the Morlock today. Um, so I'd like to thank Peter for coming over here again to Bavaria for another fantastic weekend. I mean, as you say, the game was kind of overshadowed in some ways today by the protests and, uh, you know, the ongoing and seemingly more and more crazy protests that we see over here in the Bundesrepublik related to the uh, the DFL investment deal. But yeah, I really enjoyed it this weekend. It was an interesting match. Obviously, didn't get the result uh, our FCN wanted, but another good uh, live match day. So yeah, thanks a lot, guys, and see you next.